This landmark I'm showing you is the historical Shamsan Castle. Yes, this is a castle. One of the historical sites that you should not miss visiting when you travel to the city of Abha. So for this time again, I'm happy because I'm entering another castle. This Shamsan Castle, by the way, is on top of the hill. And the mountain is right at the city center of Abha. And this is not simply a castle during those times because uh, uh, this was once a fortress, meaning a defense uh, area, a defense wall, a refuge area for the villagers whenever the enemies were attacking. Uh, they were standing on top of this hill and from this point, they could see if there were enemies coming in. You know, at that time, this place was not the same as what we had today. Now, plenty of buildings around the hill. During those times, what we had, what they had uh, below the, this mountain, were farmlands, houses of the villagers, woodlands. And, uh, you know, the area is uh, covered only by the trees. And from afar, if there were enemies coming in, they could now see and they can prepare to defend themselves now let me bring you inside the castle you know i feel so lucky because i think this is the fifth palace that i'm going to enter the first palace that i entered the very first one was the malacanang palace in the philippines yeah i remember march 1993 i was there I'm, i was so lucky at the time to have entered the malacanang palace now here uh, in uh, shamsan castle Shamsan Palace. This is what we have. It has different, uh, different chambers, several chambers, and there are open spaces probably for gatherings, for meetings, or whatever during those times. And uh, here is the King Usama, <laughs> my captain. Thank you so much for being, uh, bringing me here. Behind this wall, by the way, uh, it's already the slope of the hill and the road. Okay, I am inside a castle. Actually, this castle used to be a fortress way back 100 years ago. One thing I noticed, by the way, of all the palaces and old houses that I have entered here in Saudi Arabia, I noticed that the walls are thick, just like this one. I think it's more or less two meters. Wow. And here is another open space used for gathering probably during those times. Whenever I entered, by the way, old palace and old castles reminds me of my childhood days. Way back then, we used to listen to a radio drama, Zimatar! <laughs> yes, uh, yes, that's true. Uh, the story was about the fights uh, between kingdoms. You know, those times were the heydays of uh, radio entertainment. So we used to listen to a radio drama. But now I'm inside the palace and it's real. Alright, so we inside Shamasan Castle. Um, this castle at least 100 years old. Back in the days when the uh, Turkish tried to invade the region, Assyria region. Uh, they actually... Uh, built the castle then the locals got the castle the, um, a week or like a month after and it has a um, um, strategic location in the corner of the city so they can see any uh, attacks it has a watch uh, wa uh, watching watch tower. yeah watchtower watch <laughs> in the corner of the castle um, yeah um, they, they, they used it for years and years uh, to protect the city and the region Now, I'm um, going out from uh, this uh, beautiful and exciting tour inside the Shamasan Palace. This is the way we pass through because uh, the main gate actually is closed. Now, here is the arrival area. Uh, by the way, again, this is on top of the hill. And uh, from this point, what you are going to see is the beautiful city side of Abha. Outside the castle, uh, what you are going to enjoy is uh, the view of the city side of Abha. And I suggest that coming here uh, should be late afternoon and stay here until after sunset. 
because uh, you will enjoy looking at the uh, flickering lights of the city illuminating the place so again this is in Shamasan Palace here in the city of Abha Aser province Saudi Arabia mm -hmm. 